There had already been work ongoing on the roof of the Dina Towers, but this morning the rain proved to be too much. Water gushed in on the sixth floor. It flooded the apartment of Linda Hasher, who says it's been an ongoing problem. I woke up and we'd had dripping throughout the night, and as you can see, buckets behind me. And uh, I sat up, I was on the couch, and I sat up, and I saw the bulge right here. I saw a bulge, and I didn't have time to notice anything else because all of a sudden it just went whoosh and came tumbling down. 100 people have been evacuated from Dina Towers. The Red Cross is putting some of them up in hotels. The Cheviot Memorial Fieldhouse is being used as a shelter for the night as well. I, I have nowhere to go. My insurance says they'll pay for it, but I have to pay the first $500. Uh, so, I'm stuck. I can't go to a shelter because I have an animal. So, I'm extremely frustrated, yes. The fire department has evacuated the building because they're worried about the water shorting out the electrical system and starting a fire. From Cheviot, Bill Reinhart, News Radio 700 WLW.